Hey everybody, Carl here from AFT. We're at CES 2020 in the Alpine booth and we've got our old pal Chris here who's going to talk to us about a, a new amplifier as well as kind of how it worked within a, an ecosystem for Alpine. What are we looking at? All right, so last year we actually launched uh, our series uh, amplifier, which we're really excited about. We had a two, ch or, sorry, a four channel amp and a mono block, but we were kind of missing that multi-channel, the five channel. So instead of just coming out with another five channel, uh, we decided to do a six channel with staggered power. Okay. So what that actually means is it does four, uh, 75 watt by four, plus 150 watt by two at four ohm, and can be bridged all the way up to 500 watt on that single channel at four ohm, wow. which means you can power a subwoofer as well. So now you can treat it as a five channel amp, and then in the future, if you want to upgrade to more complex system like a three-way active, you can actually do that with this same amplifier. So, for example, right here. exactly, in this system here, we actually have our new uh, three-inch mid-range, a 30 MC, powered in, in total with that six-channel amp. So we have those 150-watt channels run to the mid-range to get that nice, healthy mid-base. Mm -hmm. We have 75-watt to the mid and 75-watt to the tweeter. So now you can do a full active system. Uh, the rears are run off deck power because you don't really need a whole lot of power for the rear. And then we have amplifiers running our subwoofers independently. So now you can do a full halo uh, design system, right, using uh, several products from our R-Series lineup to create that really immersive sound. That's really cool, and we had a chance to listen to this a little bit earlier, and uh, there's no enclosures on anything. It's just kind of speakers in a wall, and it really does sound incredible. So it is something you guys are going to want to stop by the store and check out if you're in the Chicagoland area. Thanks, as always, Chris, for all the information. Guys, stay tuned because we're going to have more coming up from CES 2020.